Welcome to University of Portland, a liberal arts Catholic Holy Cross University consistently ranked top 10 in the West. UP's world-class experiential education engages the whole person, head, heart, and hands. Whether they're studying in the College of Arts and Sciences or one of the four professional schools of business, engineering, nursing, and health innovations, and education. Located in Portland, Oregon, UP is perched above the scenic Willamette River. Surrounded by evergreen trees and situated in one of the top destinations for food, arts and culture, and outdoor adventure. I'm your host, Alex Boylan, and we are about to explore this absolutely beautiful campus and meet students who are among the 3,500 pilots of all identities and backgrounds who call UP home. We'll hear from future engineers, nurses, actors, and Division I athletes who are taking full advantage of the opportunities and support UP offers, all while having the time of their lives. Welcome to University of Portland. This is the College Tour. Let's meet Denver, a UP senior who puts learning into action to help others. That's an essential part of student education at UP, where internships, practicums, and service work are built into the curriculum. Inspired by that, Denver harnessed support from faculty, staff, and fellow students to build a hydroponic farm right here on campus. Tell us more, Denver. Thanks, Alex. As a kid, I spent a lot of time attending sporting events at UP, and the camaraderie I experienced on campus left a big impression. So when I started looking at colleges, I knew that the University of Portland was the right fit for me. UP really encourages you to explore your interests and test your ideas with full support from faculty and staff. Take me for example. Even though I'm studying computer science, I wanted to do something about food insecurity. So I built a hydroponic garden to grow food indoors. My next challenge was to scale it up for large populations. I proposed building a hydroponic farm with an automatic harvesting system as a capstone project. UP agreed and even let me build it right in the basement of our Shiley Hall, our engineering building on campus. I received awards from the Pilot Venture Challenge and grants from the City of Portland that allowed me to turn my idea into a 501c3 nonprofit. Not only have I grown food for those who need it, I've also built an organization that supports another capstone team as an industry sponsor. This kind of hands-on experience is such a big part of UP. More than 80% of students participate in experiential learning opportunities. And our new Shiley Marcos Center for Design and Innovation offers more than 45,000 square feet of makerspaces, labs, and studios. Students from all majors can design, build, and test their ideas together under one roof. Since every project in the Shiley School of Engineering is paired with an industry advisor, I've been able to gain real-world experience and build my professional network at the same time. My career is still undecided, but I know that UP is giving me the tools I need to succeed no matter where I go next. Back to you, Alex. Denver, what you've accomplished as an undergrad is absolutely incredible. Thanks for showing us how UP supports students in their drive to make positive change in the world. Engineering for impact is the Shiley School of Engineering's motto. And you've clearly taken that to heart. Thanks again for sharing. I can't wait for you to meet Leah, who like 70% of UP students, hails from outside the state of Oregon. She's all about exploring. And with the Pacific Ocean in our west and Mount Hood's 10 months ski season in our east, UP is the perfect place for discovery in the classroom and out. Leah, you are up. Thanks, Alex. Hey, y'all. I honestly had no idea where to start when it came to deciding on the college. I grew up in a small town in Texas, and the only thing I did know is I definitely wanted to go out of state for school. I first visited Oregon my junior year of high school, and I kind of fell in love with the trees here. So when I found out Forest Park, which is one of the largest urban parks in the nation, and is just across the river from campus and has over 80 miles of hiking trails, I knew I had to go to UP. University of Portland has given me my perfect home base to explore the Pacific Northwest. When I'm not hiking in Forest Park, I make day trips to Cannon Beach with my friends and road trips up to Olympic National Park. And the Outdoor Pursuits program also offers group trips, plus all the gear. Go hiking, camping, kayaking, and even rock climbing nearly every week. 
I've also been doing a lot of exploring on campus. I knew I wanted to study political science, but I also love creative writing and theater. And I was kind of worried I'd have to choose, but the classes and clubs here at UP allow me to pursue all of my interests. I even have the opportunity to start my own writing club. I also became a Moreau Center Service and Justice Coordinator in my residence hall, which has given me a new perspective of what doing my part to better the community really looks like. UP is so intentional in ensuring every student has the knowledge, support, and opportunities to pursue whatever sparks their interests. I've learned there's no better place to find or fulfill your passions than among a supportive and genuinely welcome community at UP. That's all for me. Take it away, Alex. Leia standing in the heart of campus, overlooking the city of Portland with tall trees as far as the eye can see. I definitely agree. The idyllic Pacific Northwest is brimming with opportunity. It's great to see you taking full advantage of your liberal arts education and pursuing your passions. Thanks again. Let's hear from Kirsten, a senior ROTC cadet from Guam, who's paying forward the support she receives to the next generation of students. Whether you're the first in your family to attend college or amongst a long line of alums, every student faces challenges. When they do, UP is there to help with academic tutoring, mental health counseling, affinity groups, and much more. Fill us in, Kirsten. Thanks for the intro, Alex. I always knew I wanted to attend college. The question was, which one? I knew I wanted a place that was far away, yet close to home, supportive inside and outside of my academics, I was going to develop me as a leader and a person. University of Portland ticked all those boxes. I'm the first in my family to attend college, and when I came to UP from Guam, it was my first time I'd come to the mainland too. It was a shock all around, but the support I received these past three years, especially from my professors in the Pamplin School of Business, has been a huge contributor to my success. I take pride in seeing my name each semester on the Dean's List and being an Air Force ROTC cadet has contributed tremendously to my growth as a leader. The leadership skills I've learned in the Air Force ROTC program has prepared me to become a student coordinator for UP's first generation program, which provides support, mentoring, special programs, and engagement opportunities for first generation students like me. The FGEM program is one of many ways UP actively supports students on their academic journey from mental health services in the Counseling Center, to academic assistance and the Shepherd Academic Resource Center, not to mention the faculty librarians who make college-level research a lot less intimidating, there's always someone to help you every step of the way. My time on the Bluff has given me the confidence to embark on another journey, revitalizing the Chamorro Club for students coming from the Mariana Islands and Micronesia. Thanks to UP and the ways it has helped me grow, I know I'll be prepared to be a United States Air Force officer when I graduate. Back to you, Alex. Wow, Kirsten, you've done an amazing job navigating college life so far from home and helping others do the same. Your story proves that we're stronger when we work together. And that commitment to community is what defines the UP experience. Thanks for sharing. Let's meet Ian, a senior in the Shiley School of Engineering. Ian is one of those students who could fill an entire episode with everything he's involved in. At the center of it all is Ian's faith journey. And pay special attention to the unique way he gets around campus. Ian, you're on. Thanks, Alex. Yes, I am a senior computer science major, but that's only part of my UP story. I started out as a commuter student, and with so many events and activities happening day and night, I found myself spending all of my time on campus. I got involved in clubs and campus ministry and quickly made a ton of friends. Attending a Catholic university was really important to me, and UP's campus ministry is one of my favorite things about the school. I've been on several retreats, joined clubs like Catholic Conversations, and FISH, our non-denominational Christian club. I sing with the chapel choir, and I play piano for the daily masses in the residence halls. I'm always finding something fun happening on campus, from free mocktails in St. Mary's Lounge to cultural events like Hawaii's Club Luau. 
You especially don't want to miss Rock the Bluff, a huge concert that brings in big talent each spring. And during the holidays, we light up the tallest living Christmas tree in the state of Oregon. Alongside all those clubs and activities, I'm also getting great preparation for my career. I traveled to Florida for a NASA competition with the Robotics Club, and through the Multiple Engineering Co-op program, I got two paid six-month internships. My first one being at Daimler Trucks, which has given me the best work experience I could have asked for. UP really invests in its students, offering a wide range of programs to gain real-world experience outside of the classroom. And the Career Education Center does an incredible job connecting students with internships, jobs, and networking opportunities, so we're prepared for whatever comes next. I was worried about making friends and pursuing my faith in college, but now I'm known as the unicycle guy who's involved in pretty much everything. I really found my people and my place at University of Portland. Back to you, Alex. Time to roll to my next class. And I think that's a college tour. First, a musically gifted robotics club leader who rolls up on a unicycle. No matter how you show up, you're a shining example of UP's mission in action with faith and formation as key pillars of the student experience. Thanks again, Ann. Let's jump into campus life with Alana a first-year pilot who immediately discovered that small class sizes plus a huge array of clubs and activities equals a sense of community. With 10 residence halls housing nearly 2,500 students on campus, you'll always see a familiar face walking the quad or studying in the library. Alana, let's hear it. Thanks, Alex. Since I was little, I love performing and socializing. So I wanted a college where I could form close connections and explore all aspects of my creativity. The University of Portland was the perfect place for me. I'm in my first year on the bluff and it's been so easy to connect to the UP community. The first week of school, I attended the activities fair and discovered more than 100 clubs to participate in. I joined SLUG, the student-led Unity Garden, where we grow produce for the community. And I became an event coordinator for the Black Student Union. This is my favorite club because it's where I feel most understood and can be around people that have similar experiences. I also joined student government as a class senator. You can get as involved as you want when you come here. There's a place for everyone. Being in the honors program really helped me feel at home too. As a member, I'm a part of a tight-knit group of students of all majors who take core classes together, collaborate on research projects, and get advice and support from faculty mentors. In fact, faculty support is one of UP's biggest strengths. All classes are taught by faculty, not grad students. And with a nine to one student faculty ratio, the professors really get to know who you are and are always ready to help, whether it's understanding the material or mapping out your post-grad plans. UP offers so many ways to try new things and meet new people. And the community I found has been incredibly welcoming. I can't wait to see how my next three years unfold. No matter what you wanna do, it's all here for you at UP. I'm so proud to be a pilot. Take it away, Alex. You're right, Alana, it is all here for you. And if you love being near the water, you can walk to UP's River Campus, which includes a state-of-the-art environmental lab where students explore the ever-changing river. There's a private dock for the women's rowing team, and what a scenic spot for intramural sports. Cheers, Alana. We're now kicking it over to Oliver, who traveled all the way from Copenhagen to play soccer for UP. The pilots, 16 NCAA Division I sports programs in the West Coast Conference turn out a steady stream of pro athletes and Olympians. But these talented athletes are students first and UP offers an array of resources to help them make the most of their education. Take it away, Oliver. Thanks, Alex. It's always been my dream to play soccer at the highest level as possible. So when I got the opportunity to play for University of Poland, one of the best soccer programs in the whole country, I felt I was one step closer to achieve that goal. At first, it was a bit tough being so far away from home, but the people here are so nice and it didn't take long for UP to feel like another home. Since it's a smaller school, it's really easy to make friends. Plus, there's always something fun to do, like dominating the ping pong table in my dorm or hitting the food carts nearby. 
And shout out to Outdoor Pursuits for always putting on some great hiking trips. You just sign up and go for it. Being a student athlete means that I spend a lot of time on the field, but UP has a lot of good resources to help you get the most out of your classes. And seeing friends and other UP athletes in the stands going crazy cheering for you is just an incredible feeling. It's like we're one big family. When I'm out there playing, hearing the Villa drum squad and knowing those are my dorm mates making all that noise, it's just so cool to have all that support. What I do after my graduation is still a big question. But since coming to UP, I matured a lot and expanded my view on the world. I learned so much from my classes and met friends from all over the globe. I'm not scared of trying new stuff anymore and see what comes out of it. And every morning I wake up knowing there's something to achieve and something to look forward to. Well, that's all for me. Taking the ball back to you, Alex. Wow, Oliver. Clearly, pilots excel in the classroom and on the field. Nearly half of UP's athletes make the Dean's List while consistently leading their teams to postseason tournaments. Named after riverboat pilots who use their expertise and courage to navigate through the treacherous Columbia River, UP pilots are an impressive bunch. Thanks again. Please say hello to Zora, a sophomore who is taking full advantage of Portland's close-knit network of over 200 performing and fine arts venues. With close proximity and faculty connections to the thriving arts scene, Zora can perform both on and off campus, all while taking advantage of a wide range of faculty research projects and internships. You're on, Zora. Thanks, Alex. Growing up, I was always super involved in theater and music. I love the way performance brings people together through a shared experience. But I also have a deep love for history and literature, and I knew I wanted to attend a college where I wouldn't have to give up my interests. I toured UP after a colleague of mine at a local Shakespeare company shared how great their experience here had been, and I knew it was the perfect fit for me. Here at UP, I've been able to do it all. I performed in plays on stage. I worked backstage building costumes as a student worker in the costume shop. I play violin in the orchestra and I'm a member of the University Singers. UP's small class sizes and sense of community have allowed me to foster strong relationships with my professors and seize unique opportunities like participating in the brand new arts administration major, which blends business and performance classes and connects students to jobs and internships in one of the more than 200 arts organizations in Portland. At UP, I've also had the opportunity to work in areas outside of my major. Currently, I'm on a team with a theology professor investigating the intersections of queerness and faith at Holy Cross institutions. The Summer Undergraduate Research Experience, or SURE, is one of the many ways students can gain valuable research experience as early as their first year, a rarity at larger universities. I'm excited to know my UP education is preparing me to enter the world of performing arts with a well-rounded education that will help me stand out in my industry. That's all from me, Alex. Back to you. Thank you, Zora. You've had incredible experiences on stage, backstage, and in the classroom. It's clear that UP's faculty are invested in helping students to pursue all their interests. And with so much to explore in Portland, you never know where that might lead. Have fun out there, Zora. Ready to tell us more about UP's commitment to service and justice is Israel, a secondary education major who's already making a difference in the community. Here at UP, once a pilot, always a pilot. And that's because UP students aim to make a meaningful impact on the world during their time here and long after they've graduated. Israel, tell us more. Thank you, Alex. Hello, everyone. Education has always been very important to me and my family. And when my mom went back to school to study education, it sparked my own love for teaching and learning. I wanted to go to a college that valued education as much as I did and saw it as a way to make positive change in the world, not just a means to a degree. That is what led me to the University of Portland. At UP, we're encouraged to use knowledge to serve others. And this has given me many ways to connect with people on campus and in the surrounding communities. It started my first year in the School of Education program when I was placed in a local elementary school to start earning my 1,200 hours of required field experience. It allowed me to really get to know the teachers, staff, and students and help me better understand where they're coming from 
and how best to support them. I especially love building relationships with people through doing service work. I'm going on my third year as a coordinator with the Moreau Center for Service and Justice, which connects students with internships, immersion experiences, service work, and other programs that address community needs while raising students' awareness of injustice. My work with the Moreau Center allows me to bring others from my dorm to engage with the community, learn about issues, and take action. I have not only grown professionally here at the University of Portland, but I've also grown in the way that I think about my life and what is truly important to me. No matter how you get involved on campus, there's a sense of belonging to something bigger that is really empowering. That's all I got. Back to you, Alex. Israel, you are an inspiration. It's incredible to know that UP students have so many opportunities to participate in service and justice immersions, service work, and internships that connect what they're learning in their courses to real-world socioeconomic issues happening locally and around the world. Thanks again for sharing. Let's hear from Julia a nursing student who's busy developing her patient care skills and enjoying UP's access to the outdoors. No matter what major you choose, at UP, hands-on experience will play a big role. And the on-campus Simulated Healthcare Center for Nursing Majors is a prime example. Give us the inside scoop, Julia. Thanks, Alex. Hi, everyone. Back home in Alaska, I volunteer as an EMT at the fire department and in the neonatal intensive care unit in the hospital. Through these experiences, I learned how much I enjoy patient care, but I also like playing music and spending time outdoors. So I chose a school where I could get the best nursing education and still do all of the things I love, the University of Portland. When I first visited UP, the pop band was playing and they showed me around the music hall. I was sold. I'm now in the pep band myself and the jazz ensemble. This year, I started a running club and we take advantage of all of the great trails just minutes from campus. We can even use the school's vans to travel. So far, the nursing program has been everything I wanted. The program is direct admit, so you know you're in as soon as you're accepted to UP. Best of all, as a sophomore, you get to use the phenomenal Simulated Health Center. It's the only fully accredited, state-of-the-art sim lab in the state, where you can practice your nursing skills on realistic mannequins and patient actors. By junior year, you'll be practicing in real healthcare settings during your clinicals. And there are other hands-on opportunities too. I have a paid internship in malaria research, and I'm hoping to join the Summer Study Abroad program in East Africa to learn about global healthcare. When I graduate, I plan on returning to Alaska to start my nursing career. But knowing how much I've learned and experienced since coming to UP, who knows where my final years on the bluff will take me. One thing's for sure, I can't wait to find out. Back to you, Alex. Wow, Julia, classroom lessons look different when they're applied to real life, don't they? That's why UP emphasizes hands-on experience, whether it's working on research or taking advantage of the wealth of internship opportunities in all fields just minutes from campus in the Portland metro area. Thanks, Julia. Let me introduce you to Darius, a first-year student who literally found a world of opportunities and the peer and faculty support to make the most of them. From the day a UP student arrives on the bluff, they're gonna feel welcomed and valued. Darius, please tell us more about your journey so far. Thanks for having me here, Alex. As a child, my mother would always remind me that school is my job my top priority. And that's why finding a college that had an environment where I could be myself and thrive in was really important to me. After all, if you're gonna live where you learn, you wanna surround yourself with people who are gonna have a positive impact on you. Out of all the colleges I visited, the University of Portland was the only place that had everything I was looking for. Not only the academics, but also a warm, welcoming environment. UP is a place where I feel at home. 
where I can enjoy some of my favorite things outside of classes, like hanging out with friends, watching movies, or exploring all the cool stuff happening around the city. And if you're into fitness like I am, our Bochamp Recreation and Wellness Center is a state-of-the-art hub on campus for working out and staying active. The school also provides an abundance of resources for whatever it is you may need to level up in your education and ultimately succeed in your career. Take UP Study Abroad program. Research shows that students who study abroad develop valuable professional skills like adaptability, self-awareness, and confidence. That's why UP designs its programs to give all majors the opportunity to complete required coursework abroad while experiencing and learning from other cultures. In most cases, your financial aid goes with you and the advisors work hard to make the transition as smooth as possible. I plan to study abroad next year and gain a global perspective on business. I know my experience will have an incredible impact on both my career and my life. Alex, back to you. Darius, the world awaits. UP Study Abroad program is truly world-class. There's a campus in Salzburg, Austria, and opportunities to explore a host of other destinations. England, Australia, France, Spain, and Italy, to name just a few. We can't wait to see what you do in the future with that fresh global perspective and a UP business degree. Take care. What an amazing group of students thriving here at UP. With a combination of academic rigor, faculty support, experiential learning, and liberal arts discovery. Plus, big city fun and outdoor adventure. Thank you for sharing your stories with us. Being on this gorgeous campus, I see how UP nurtures a lifetime love of learning and service, encourages students to question everything, think big, take risks, and give back. Now, you have to see these 150 acres of Pacific Northwest beauty for yourselves and get to know this diverse and welcoming community. But don't go just yet. I had the pleasure this week of speaking with the president of UP. So stay tuned for the credits to watch that. Cheers, everyone. What makes UP different and distinctive? That's a hard thing to choose, but I would say at the University of Portland, you don't have to choose. Uh, students are gonna be known, cared for, loved. And they're gonna experience a Holy Cross Catholic, care for the whole person kind of hospitality. Um, but we have faculty who wanna teach, wanna teach undergraduate students, wanna get to know them, but Division I athletics in a great city, um, the Pacific Northwest, it's a great place. Yeah, how great. Yeah. yeah, what a great place to be a president, huh? It's wonderful. Yeah.